it's, uh, it's a kind of an odd thing to get an award like this before uh, uh, the film has even come out, but uh, <laughs> fingers crossed. I, I think ability is of little account without opportunity, and thank you sincerely for this opportunity here tonight. I really appreciate it, everybody. Thank you very much. All you guys, the distributors, you really are the enablers, and I love my job. Thank you for enabling me to do it. I remember when I was puttering around in the 90s, kind of poking along, and uh, George found a couple of series of movies, Parent Trap, Frequency, Mr. Emmerich, and uh, finally The Rookie, which gave me a second act. And uh, second acts are sweet. Thank you very much. I was thinking about my last trip to Vegas today, reminiscing, and um, it was about 110 degrees out, and uh, curdled my Canadian blood and I recall driving around in a car lost in the old part of Vegas um, with no air conditioning and uh, a guy named Elvis and uh, so this is a lot better. <laughs> a lifetime achievement. I feel it might be over. I keep making movies as you see, I've got one to come out. Is, is there anybody there? And then they give me a lifetime achievement. And I think, oh, this is a hint. I've got to stop. So I don't know whether to stop accepting lifetime achievement awards or stop making movies. So I've decided to do both. I'm going to accept lifetime achievement awards and keep making movies. <laughs> <laughs>